In this video, we're going to look at a part of Automator's complete marking line, specifically the laser marking. The two products that we're going to focus on are the Viz and the NanoViz. After looking at a few of their features, we'll also look at a few example marks. Starting with the NanoViz, this is an extremely small laser designed for benchtop use. All marks are developed on a PC and controlled from there. These marks can include serial numbers, 2D barcodes, images, and many other features. This laser is ideal for small run marking. What makes it unique is its A-Wave technology for automatically regulating the frequency, allowing it to change and adjust for the materials. This makes it perfect for marking metals, alloys, plastics, and many other materials. The next product in the Automator product family, the Viz Laser Marker, is a unique all-in-one laser whose mark alone system allows it to do pattern management without a PC connected to it during operation. As well as not requiring a PC for operation, it can be easily controlled through a PLC using I.O., Serial, or Ethernet. The system will mark serial numbers, 2D barcodes, images, and many others. It can also do an additional access for rotational marking or marking on the fly. And now let's take a quick look at a few example marks done by a Viz or a Nano Viz. The first example shows a logo being marked on a beer tap valve. Here we see critical product information being marked on a brass fitting. This is another brass part being marked. Here we see the laser's ability to mark on a curved surface. The next few marks are all being done on various aluminum cookware products. Here we see a very high speed mark of a 2D barcode being put on a plastic part. Another example of marking on plastic, but in some cases here, we're marking on an uneven or curved surface. Showing off the polish of the mark, here we're marking on a chromed plastic part for a faucet manufacturer. And another quick 2D mark, this time on a printed circuit board. And lastly, to show the diversity of these lasers, here we see one of the lasers marking on a dried fish. This mark now actually includes a 2D barcode for traceability. 